Dr. Sandra Swain, um, can you tell me a little more about triple negative breast cancer? You hear a lot about triple negative breast cancer now. It's the hot topic that all the researchers and even all the patients are talking about. And what triple negative means is that the tumor does not have either estrogen, progesterone receptor, or the HER2 gene. And the estrogen and progesterone receptor are proteins that are regulated by hormones in the body. And the HER2 gene is a specific cancer gene in the tumor itself. So triple negative means that those tests are all negative in the tumor and that we don't have a specific targeted therapy for that tumor. Now, is it hard to diagnose or a lot of people come in and just say, oh my goodness, I have some type of breast cancer, but I don't know what that is? No, it's not hard at all to diagnose because we routinely test the tumors for ERPR and HER2. So it's very easily diagnosed and it occurs in about 15% of all the breast cancers diagnosed and it is higher in younger African American women. What are the latest research with uh, triple negative? Well, everybody's interested in this topic, so there's not a, anything definitive right now. What some of the research shows is that even though these patients who have triple negative disease feel that things are very grim for them, if it's an early diagnosis, their, their tumors actually respond better to chemotherapy than some of the other different tumors. So that's the good news about this. And we're doing lots of research all over the country and trying to actually identify a specific target or some kind of gene or protein in these tumors because it's a little bit of a misnomer in a way to say triple negative and to label it that way. It's just that we haven't been smart enough yet to figure out what the target is that's in those tumors. Um, if a woman is diagnosed with, with triple negative, what is her course of treatment? If a woman's diagnosed with an early breast cancer, meaning that she is going to get local treatment and, and adjuvant treatment, then she should definitely get chemotherapy in almost all cases, of course, unless it's a very small tumor. Because as I said before, patients who do have triple negative disease seem to respond better or have a better outcome when they get chemotherapy. Because triple negative tumors for the most part are associated with tumors that are growing faster. Tumors that are growing faster respond better to chemotherapy.